live from the Carl Chevrolet Studios in West Des Moines, this is Iowa Live. It is time to head on over to the Animal Rescue League of Iowa and meet a, somebody who's looking for a forever home. And no, it's not Carrie Spain. Carrie is standing there. And now it looks like you have a trained pig there, Carrie. Yeah, well, we're working on sit. <laughs> <laughs> Look at He's this. Who is he this? He likes his apple, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> This is Paya. Paya. Oh. Yes. <laughs> and you can see Paya is over at the Second Chance Ranch. Akari is the coordinator over there. And what do people need to know about Paya except that he's very, very cool? Yeah. He's um, he's a younger kid, probably one or two years old. And uh, <laughs> he's been neutered and microchipped. And we're, you know, he's. We can't house train him real well here. We'll just let him eat his apples. There you go. Um, just because we don't have an outside place for him to go, but very trainable. He's been a really sweet pig. Um, very friendly. Look at you know, that face. That is such a cool looking animal, Carrie. He's got a lot of hair. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of home does he need to be in? Well, um, you know, He'd love to have a place outside to run around. So, you know, a good fenced in area for him outside, but he can be trained to be inside too. Okay. Yeah. And they are very smart, aren't they? Oh, yes. Very trainable. Yeah. But you can see that you're in a stall. Uh, you're at the Second Chance Ranch at the Animal Rescue League's main area, yes. uh, the, the main location. And you have a lot of other animals there, including horses. And there's something very special going on with horses coming up, right? Yes, so next Saturday, next Saturday, we will have our Helpful Horse Home Day. So we'll have an open house or open barn, I should say. And we also will be, so people can come in and meet the animals we have, not just the horses. We've got goats and pigs and ducks and chickens and, um, and horses. <laughs> and we'll also be having a blanket wash, horse blanket wash. So people have those muddy horse blankets they can't take to the laundromat they can bring them in we'll wash them in our washer and dryer for a fee and all that money goes back to feed these animals here at the second chance ranch <laughs> I, i'm getting a kick out of the tail wagon when they're eating the apples <laughs> <laughs> that, yeah. that is very fun. Speaking of fun, we are going to have a ball tomorrow night in downtown Des Moines, the 30th annual Raise Your Paw auction for the Animal Rescue League of Iowa. How much fun is this going to be, Carrie? Yeah, so lots of fun this year. There'll be a kittle, kitty, uh, kitten cuddling room, lots of live music with some great entertainment, uh, tons of live live and silent auction items um and all the money goes back to helping feed the animals and care for the animals here at the rescue league yeah we also understand there's a superhero theme this year and you have a superhero photo but look at those super cats that are going to be on <laughs> hand we have uh you know what that they're going to be representing in big time in big fashion and look at there's the super dog with the red cape that will be there representing in big fashion as well but this is gonna this is the biggest fundraiser of the year for the animal rescue league of iowa and it happens tomorrow night uh, Carrie, do you know, are there still some tickets available? There are. Um, not not very many, though. So I just looked right before we went on, and there's just a few left, few okay. seats left. Right. If they want to go, it's best to get on there as soon as possible. And Look at the entertainment that we're talking about. You said live music, but I want to mention the B-Twins are going to be there, so you know it's going to be great. Joshua Sinclair is going to be there. You know he rocks the joint. And Andrew Hoyt is going to be there, and he is a legend here in central Iowa, uh, has great music. And all three of those performers, uh, all, actually all four with the B-Twins, all four of them will be performing tomorrow night. It gets underway about 5 o'clock. That's for the silent auction the live auction gets started a couple of hours after that that is very very cool but hey one other thing uh since we have you here uh can we talk about the 65 dogs that the arl rescued uh in keokuk county this past week how are those dogs doing yeah they're doing good i mean obviously there's a lot of medical issues that need to be uh treated but so far so good um you know a lot of puppies a lot of hair matted parasites 
um, some injuries, but you know, they're getting the care they need and, and all is going well so far. Yeah, you had a chance to bring them back over to the ARL. I you see those pups are just barely being weaned and uh, they needed attention there, but you have them yeah. now and we always can use assistance with that. And the raise your paw auction tomorrow night that will all go to help the animals, including some of those. We want to give additional donations. What's the best place that people can go and find out about the pig too? Yeah, so she, I mean, he, he's a boy, um, on our website, second chance, the uh, ARL-Iowa.org website under Second Chance Ranch, and you can fill out an a interest form, and it will come to us um, to be, if you're interested in adopting. All right, great information. Uh, Paya is going to get a new home, and hopefully, look at that. Paya could be in your backyard. It could be your forever pet. That is so neat. <laughs> Carrie Spain, have yourself a great weekend, and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow night at the 30th <laughs> Annual Animal Rescue League Raise Your Paw Auction. Thank you. Thank you so much, Carrie. Uh, what a great, great organization, and you guys have a great weekend. See you back here Monday on Iowa Live.